Andy in Seattle. What's up, Andy? Hey, Mike. How are you? How are you? Good, thanks. I uh, heard you earlier today. You mentioned two teams from the West, uh, Texas, and they're having a great year. Millwood's pitching great. They got, you know, the bumpers and the thumpers in their lineup. You mentioned the Angels. Based on recent history, you got to include them as the team to beat. They got John Lackey. He's one of those guys where, you know, statistics and numbers don't really matter because he's risen to the occasion, especially against uh, the Yankees. But the one team that I, I haven't heard you mention, and I – Let's be fair, they might be doing it with some smoke and some mirrors, but they're quietly just winning. They won eight out of nine series in June. I know who uh, it is. Mariners. I know who it is. You know, three games over. Five now, let me days. explain to you. The Mariners and I have a problem because last year I loved the Mariners, okay? We, 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 we loved the, the Mariners were our team last year. We loved them. Their number was like 86 they were the now team. Stottlemyre told us the best young arms I've ever seen. Blah, 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 blah. We love the Mariners. We picked them as an over. They were the worst. Puts blew two saves the first weekend in Baltimore. The team was net. The, the Baltimore that, scenario. Right. We're at one game where King Felix had pitched a one-hitter into the ninth inning. You remember that game? Uh, I and, remember, yeah. yeah eight and innings. The, yep. And, oh, my God. I mean, they never recovered. And I have a mental block with the I, – I have a problem. I can't even deal with the Mariners this year. So, I, 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 you're right. They're playing much better. Now, they want to trade Bedard, though, don't they? Well, Bedard, he, that's the thing. He, he has a good record, 5-2, and two, low ERA. But he just went on the DL. He's eligible. He was actually eligible to come off a couple of days ago. Right, and they were babying him. Yeah, and they want to trade him from what I understand, right? Well, this is, this is the road trip, which would basically indicate what they're going to do because they – they got the Dodgers, they had the, and, the and, Yankees, and then the Red Sox. And it's also, like you, you you would trade Beltray too, wouldn't you? Well, well, here's a, you know how Beltray he just went on the yeah, DL, DL himself. Yeah. He's going under the nice tomorrow. Oh, he's so is he, how, how long has he gone for? They say eight weeks. Oh, so that's it for him. Now, Branson's been very good, and Ichiro's having a great year. I know that. And Griffey's not hitting, but he's had some big hits, right? Griffey, he's had, he had a... Game tying home run in the bottom of the ninth against Arizona. No, he's hitting 218, but he's had, yeah, but he's had some big hits for you guys. He hasn't hit for average, but he's had some big hits. Yeah, he, he doesn't have. Uh, you're right. The average is low. He's got some big home runs. He doesn't play the field that often because he's got to get his knee drained, which was weird to see him out in Dodger Stadium yesterday. Track down some now, fly Bel balls for now, seven innings. Now Beltre was in the lineup yesterday, wasn't he? Right, because they, they knew, you know, it was a weird scenario because they knew he was going under the knife on Tuesday. So he played anyway, able, huh? Yeah, he was able to play. You know, the, the, the manager gave him a lot of credit, and uh, obviously, the you know, Dave Sims, who does a great job, he, he was pretty impressed, too. So now but they, they – okay. Your, but, but, I mean, they're going to lose Beltre. Uh, they're trying to trade Bedard. Uh, it doesn't sound like they're going to stay three games over 500. Although Ichiro's hitting 370, they got a good year out of Branson, who's done very well. And Griffey's had, you know, some moments. He's hitting 218, but he's had some big hits. Uh, they've done a good job, no question. King Felix has been good. You know, he's got great stuff. They've done a good job to stay over 500. Yeah, I didn't realize. You know, that's why I'm saying I didn't realize Beltre was going to the knife because I heard he was hurt last week, but then he was in the lineup all weekend. Yeah, no, but he had been hurt last week. I saw it, but then he was playing all weekend, so I figured he was okay. And now he's going back under that night, even though he played yesterday. He was in a lineup yesterday, about in third. Five o'clock, here's Mr. Mack.